My son was one when I finally got sober. And I used to think he, he should have been enough for me to want to get clean and sober. But really, I, I just remember having a moment in rehab where I thought, I just don't want to die, you know? I'm Peter Avedisov. I'm studying a Bachelor of Counselling, majoring in psychology at uh, Griffith University. I'm 34. I have a seven-year-old boy, work casually as a mental health support worker, and study full-time at Griffith. Education in itself has just been transformative for me. I feel like I'm a different person, you know, and um, I know without education I wouldn't be where I am today. I left school in year nine, I didn't finish year 10, so uni was never in my plan. And my first house out of hospital was a supported accommodation, and a support worker there suggested, oh, maybe one day you'll be a support worker, you could do this work, and I guess it, it maybe sparked an idea and you know, I went to TAFE not long afterwards to start community services. I enjoyed that and um, thought I'd challenge myself even more and, and do a diploma in counselling and found out about a direct entry into Griffith Uni after I'd finished that. So I thought I'd challenge myself again and enrol in uni. In my second year, I received the Obedian Griffith Future Scholarship. I met with Sahil for the first time at the end of last year. There was a moment we were, we were all sitting at the table. Sahil was giving a really sort of inspiring speech and he said, all of you at the table are gonna be agents of change, you know? And I just got shivers down my spine and the atmosphere of the room just changed, you know? And I really believed what he said. It excited me, so. I guess that's my next big thing after uni. I want to do something profound to help people. I hope to solidify that dream this year, you know, with the help of Griffith Honours College. I think it's, you know, a really great experience for my son to watch me at uni and, and committed to something. You know, I think I'm modelling some really good behaviour for him. For me, being remarkable is um, existing outside my comfort zone for for any amount of time. I consider that to be where a lot of my growth has come from, from being uncomfortable and, and challenging myself with things I, I didn't think were possible.